welcome back to our IB Chemistry video series. This is the only video in IB Chemistry Topic 3, Periodicity, where we will be looking at the periodic table, periodic trends, and periodic groups. The periodic table is a table of all known elements, arranged in order of increasing atomic number. As you will know from our IB Chemistry Topic 2 video series, the position of an element on the periodic table reveals its electronic configuration with regards to the s, p, d and f orbitals. There are two additional rules that you will hopefully remember from before IB, which are the group number shows the number of electrons in the valence shell of an element. The period number shows the number of energy levels present within an element. When looking at the periodic table, we can see that metals are generally found on the left side and non-metals on the right side. Metalloids, which are a class of elements somewhere in between metals and non-metals, are found between these two. However, we can further classify the metals, metalloids and non-metals by their specific groups. The important groups you need to memorize are Group 1, which is known as the alkali metals Group 2, which is known as the alkaline earth metals Group 3 to 12, which are known as the transition metals These will be explored in greater detail in our higher level IB Chemistry Topic 13 video series Group 17 which are known as the halogens, and group 18, which are known as the noble gases. When exploring the periodic table, the term periodicity is used to denote the repeating pattern of physical and chemical properties exhibited because of specific periodic trends. To understand these fully, we first need to explore three key terms. Nuclear charge. This is the cumulative total positive charge in the nucleus directly linked to the number of protons present. It increases across a period and down a group. Electrostatic attraction. This is the attractive force of the negative electrons towards the positive nucleus, since opposite charges attract. Shielding effect. This is the reduction of the electrostatic attraction between valence electrons and the nucleus due to the repulsion of inner electrons. It remains constant across a period but increases down a group. You've now reached the end of the preview for this IB Science video. If you want to check out the full video, head over to our website and select a membership plan today.